All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is up? ADS Play 101 here, and welcome to my live reaction of The Feels. Tekken 8 just released the trailer for Devil Jin, Zafina, Alicia, uh, Alisa, excuse me, and Lee Chao Lan. Now, out of all these characters, the only one that I really care about is Lee Chao Lan. For those of you who watch me play Tekken at any amount of time you know Lee Chao Lan has been my main since like Tekken 2 so the fact that he got announced you know they did like the leak a while back he was revealed in the leak but I need to see how they make him in this game so without further ado let's I'm, I'm not gonna say too much let's let's just watch let's see what we got Just do lead justice, man. Oh, there was Yoshimitsu. He got revealed. There's... Wait, why the hit? Hold on, wait. Wait, before we look at anything else, we... why the fuck does? Okay, like Yoshimitsu, he looked dope. Why the hell? Steve Fox looked like he got Botox injections. That's weird. Right. Leo. Nobody cares about Kuma. Nobody gives a damn about Panda. When that one tournament all of a sudden they think Panda's a shit. It's not. That go Lee right there. Okay. Why the hell is he in like a nano suit? Okay, like it's a reveal trailer, but I need to see like some gameplay. Now, one thing I gotta be honest with you is I never understood why the hell they made Jin and Devil Jin like two separate characters. That shit never made sense to me. It never made sense to me. November 2nd. Okay, so this week. Let's see. Yeah, this Thursday. Now, supposedly, in the. In the leak, there was two other characters. There was one that was some some new guy named Victor, and I can't remember who the other one was. I would have to look the leak up. Any last minute surprises? No. So I mean, I like what they did with the roster so far. Like. It's, it's actually a good starting roster. Like, I have no complaints on that. It's just... I, I never played with Steve, so it don't matter. Of course, like, Yoshimitsu, he always looked crazy. You know, I think the worst that Yoshimitsu looked was probably in, like, Tekken 3. But in this one, like, he actually looks dope. Like, he's in, like, a final form or something. He looked dope. But Steve Fox looks weird as hell. I hope this is a situation like with Scrub Fighter 5. No, you know what? Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. I hope that this is a situation where you know how in Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite Chung Lee's face kind of looked kind of weird and then he had to make changes before the full release of the game. I'm hoping this is a situation where they change Steve Fox's facial structure because he, he he literally looked weird as hell, at least from that angle. Like Leo looked dope. I hope they actually define what the hell Leo's gender is in the ending in what Street Fighter in a uh, in Tekken what six. Him and Yoshimitsu kind of confirm that that's a dude. So I hope they kind of do something like that, but regardless, I, I get I get tired of these ambiguous characters. Like, you a boy or you a girl? Like, just say it. Like, what the hell is the problem? 
I might pick up Safina because she looked dope. And this the only this this this, this makes me so happy. I don't think y'all understand. Like me being in this game is just like. And I think he's a part of the main story because I didn't play all the story missions or the story modes in um in seven because it basically was non-existent. It was just pictures. So supposedly he's a part of the main story in this one. So he looked dope. So I'm 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 just I'm just hoping that it's worth it. You know. As far as Alyssa goes, I don't really care for Alyssa. And Devil Jim again. I I don't know why the hell they just they just didn't give him the damn Devil transformation for his regular form. Now, here's my only thing. For the people that play that played Tekken 8 during the beta, I'm I'm saying this for y'all. I'm hoping they change the heat system because it feels like the V trigger system in in five up in a uh, Scrub Fighter five. I don't. I wish they didn't make the heat system like a revenge mechanic, to where if you're losing, you basically get a reward for losing. I don't like that that, that revenge mechanic. Like if they would have made it to where like the more aggressive you're being, you know, then you get access to like the heat mode. But you know. It is what it is, but that's my opinion about it. But Lee Chao Lan is in the game. I wish I would have seen some actual gameplay of him um, to really get me excited. But I'm I'm just happy that he's in the game. You know, I'm familiar with his move set and have been for many years. So I'm interested in seeing what the story is. You know, why he's dressed up like Raiden from Metal Gear. But we'll see, man. But my main's in the game. That's all I can be happy about. So with that being said, thank you guys for watching. Peace. And who are you excited to see? Matter of fact, let me look up that roster leak again. Okay, I looked it up before I ended the video. So if you can tell, like the one, two, three, four, four from the the top row four from the right that's Victor he's in the game and I'm trying to see who else didn't get announced yet that's on this roster leak I think the one in the very top right that's Leo I believe you can't really see I know everybody else got confirmed pretty much. So whoever that character that they're, that they're going to reveal for November 12th, that's somebody who wasn't leaked on the roster. I don't know if it's going to be a guest character or what. But yeah, Victor definitely is going to be one of them. So it's going to be interesting to see who he is and what he's bringing to the to the Tekken world but uh we will see but yeah so that was my reaction to the reveal trailer um i'm hoping we see some gameplay footage it's especially me personally i want to see some gameplay footage of uh, of lee so I, I, I need to see if he has what he has that's new because i doubt we're, with tekken 8 being you know getting released in what january january 24th I doubt we're going to get another beta to even test out any of these characters, but it will be dope if we get to see some gameplay footage of uh, Devil Jin, Alyssa, and Lee and, and Safina. So, that being said, again, thank you guys for watching. Peace. Uh, link to the trailer is going to be in the description. You guys can watch it yourself, and uh, I will see you guys next time for another reaction video. Peace.